so here is the video response on how to play PlayStation 1 backups on your PlayStation 2 without any mod chip boot disk all you need is you can have a like a slide card it could be homemade or you can use like a credit card or ID card but since I have my homemade slide card I'll use it so the first thing we need we need to boot up the PS2 and you let it boot up and now I sort of jumped to this screen but anyways you well you first you have to take off the front tray of your of your CD or the front part of your CD tray and um there are some screws in the back where you can screw off with a very tiny micro head screwdriver or like me you can just break it off alright so you put in a a real PlayStation 1 game this here is Street Fighter Alpha 2 and all you do is just put it in and hit the, hit the button and wait for the CD logo to pop up on the screen which it does and then you can navigate to it and then now here's the fun part you take your slide card you stick it in and you slide it and slide it out you take out this you put in your backup, this is Final Fantasy 7 one of the best games for PlayStation 1 and then you don't use the button but you push it in you take your slide card and switch it back like that. Now listen carefully to the sound because if it's running smoothly like like what a regular PS2 does then you're fine but if it's kind of like has like some sort of like um, this uh, weird noise coming out of it then you need to take your uh, slide card in and then re-slide it and slide it back in. Alright get back to the main screen you hit X And it loads. Yep, and here's the beginning. Oh yeah, and another thing, if you want to save, you need to have a PlayStation 1 memory card in order to save your uh, PlayStation 1 backup games on it or data file whatever and there we go Squaresoft and here you go since we're recording I'm also show you some gameplay see here's the controller it's a PS2 controller it's nothing different Nothing different, see? There's cloud. Alright, anyway, so that's how this thing works. If you're a slot magic user, you pretty much know how this works. And thank you for watching.